Southeast Texas underwater. There's been a lot of water that has fallen on this city. Still reeling after a tropical depression hammered the area. <laughs> Residents were frantically trying to escape the rising waters. In Beaumont, airboats surveying flooded streets for those stranded. Are you coming with us? We might not be able to come back, folks. Houston's police chief was going door to door to help residents secure their homes and evacuate. Local officials scrambling to help everyone they could. We were in the car and was the water was rising pretty fast. So I got out and saw the police standing on the bridge and I started screaming and they started screaming back and they came all the way down to the car and walked us back up here. In Harris County, hundreds of high water rescues. But tragically, one man lost his life after driving into nearly eight feet of floodwaters. The vehicle continued to go forward. It did come to a pause. And uh, according to witnesses, for some unknown reason, he just punched it and tried to drive through it some more. Roads turned to rivers. Cars stranded on Houston highways. Drivers forced to abandon their vehicles. I feel all right. I was on my way to the dentist. Okay. okay. This is pretty bad. It just It's so much and so uh, fast a time. People struggling in neck deep water. This man was spotted floating down this street. One couple in Jefferson County received this huge scare, spotting an alligator in the floodwaters near their home. That county has received more than 40 inches of rain. The most wild thing I have ever seen. Like, this is so much worse than Harvey.